Hello everyone. Today we will be learning how to draw angles. Now we have broken the series into some parts. In the first part, we will be learning to draw angles of 30 degrees, 45 degrees, 60 degrees, and 90 degrees. Now remember everyone, construction of angles is the most basic and fundamental part of constructions. Once we know how to draw angles, we will be able to make triangles, rhombus, square and everything else. So please attend this lecture very carefully. So, what all do we need to make constructions? We need a scale, a D to measure angles, a very well sharpened pencil, a good rubber, sharpener, and of course a compass to make angles. Now first of all, let's make an angle of 60 degrees. How do we go about it? Make a straight line. Draw any point from which you want to make an angle. Take your compass, open it up. Now from the point on which you want to make the angle, make an arc. From this point on the line, we cut this main arc. Now we have got one point here and our main point. When we join both the points, we get an angle of 60 degrees. Let's try and see. See, this is an angle of 60 degrees. Next, we move forward to 90 degrees. Ninety degrees. Now for ninety degrees, it's a straight angle, right angle. Make a straight line. Draw any point from where you want to make the angle. Take the compass, make an arc. Now, from this base line. We cut first arc. As discussed in the previous construction, this is the angle of 60 degree. From this 60 degree point, we cut another arc. Now, we have got two points. This is 60 degree measure, this is 120 degree measure. 90 degree is by sector of both 60 and 120. So from this point, I'll cut an arc here like this. From 120 degree also, I'll cut an arc like this. The meeting point of these two arcs, this point, will be joined with a base point. This is construction of 90 degrees. Here, if we have a look, this is an angle of 90 degrees. Next, we move forward to 30 degrees. Now, 30 degree is the angle bisector of 60 degrees for angle by sector for angle by sector we only need to bisect that particular arc draw a straight line take a point open your compass 
not to bake and draw this arc from the base point we make another arc now this was an arc of 60 degrees we have to make bisector of 60 degrees which is 30 degrees therefore I opened up my compass a bit more from this base point I will make another arc from this point of 60 degrees I will make this arc got a point from the base and this point we join the line together this will be my angle of 30 degrees let's have a look if you see this is an angle of 30 degrees next 45 degrees is angle bisector of 90 degrees that is half of 90 degrees what we'll do is let's make an angle of 45 degrees 45 degrees now mark a straight line make a point up here first of all in 45 degrees we have to make an angle of 90 degrees so let's once again make an angle of 90 degree we made this arc from the base point we have cut the arc from this 60 degree point we again cut the main arc this is point of 120 degrees opening up my compass a bit from 120 degree I do an arc from 60 degree also make sure your points are properly fixed your compass is properly fixed before you make an arc otherwise the angles will be of wrong denomination now when we join these two points this was my 90 degree angle I have to make bisector of 90 degrees that means I will make an angle a bisector from this point and this point the bisector of these two points will give me what 45 degree angle uh, let's see from this point of 90 degree I do an arc from this base point of 0 degrees I drew another arc. Now I got a point, point of intersection here. On joining the base point and this point of intersection, we have got a point. This will be a 45 degrees angle. Now let's see. See the perfect angle 45 degrees. Hope you learn something and will be continuing this series. Thank you everyone.